All right, just over here at my computer, making sure to download and install the map properly. All right, I think we're good. So welcome to Terra Swoop Force. This is a Minecraft adventure map that looks really, really friggin' amazing. Also, there's a computer over here, and the texture pack is amazing, and there's just cra it's just crazy. Let's get started with things by clicking to enter the map, and then probably walking in. Okay. We're in a helicopter right now. Oh my god, this is Oh, do we have anything in here? Anything in this this chest compartment? Do I have any any things to get? I guess it's it's supposed to be like kind of an Elytra map, but also there's gonna be just story built into that. I don't know. The the trailer looked freaking awesome. And this looks pretty awesome so far. So let's oops. That was an elegant dismount, everybody. There were stairs over there, but I elected to take it the extreme way. You know, it's pretty extreme stuff. It's built by Knox Crew. I did their their game show a while back. So uh, they know what they're doing. They usually put together some cool stuff. So ooh, what's over here? What do we have over here in the purple thing? This is Stan's Bouncy Castle. Can I bounce on it? Uh, um, like to, to a few inches high. <laughs> All right, Stan, your Bouncy Castle could use a little bit of work. It's not extreme enough, dude. We just, we just dismounted a helicopter and jumped off the platform. I think we need some more extreme things in our lives right now. Oh, welcome, welcome! We were expecting you almost half an hour ago. But being a tad late is far better than being melted to death and never showing up, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we are already running what? late, so you should probably head upstairs to begin Alan's briefing on the mission. Good luck! Have fun! Thanks! See you soon! Thanks, Sasha! Okay! Are, uh, are they gone? What? Are we finished? Whew. I can still hear- I'm right in front of you. I can still hear you. Man. Are you normally not that enthusiastic? And, and, and you- uh, yeah? You're like, oh god, I have to put on a front when he walks in. It's like the new glorious agent dude who's pretty freaking awesome. I know, I'm pretty freaking awesome. Who wouldn't want to put up a front for this? Anyway, okay. Let's go in to um, begin Alan's briefing mission and see what's going on here. What sort of worlds we gotta save? I assume that's what we gotta do. Hey, what's up, dude? You look sad. You with a big, fat, juicy, thermal resistant sandwich right now. What did you just say? You what, mate? You got some creepy sounds over there. There are a lot of people over here. Whoa, what's up, dudes? <laughs> Good one, Gerald. Hmm. Did I leave the stove on? This is amazing. They just have lines when you walk over to them. Ha! <laughs> That's... Uh, wow! Dude, this is so cool. Okay, I assume we have to head upstairs here to begin the next part of the briefing. That's not even, like, tied into dialogue. They're just talking. This is so cool. This is so... What the heck? The whole freaking classroom up here. And I get to start the presentation by clicking on a projector. Can I sit on this chair? I can stand on the chair. There's a computer. This is amazing. This is amazing. This is like nothing I've ever seen before. I am so honored to be a part of this agency, everybody. I just want to say that right off the bat. Let's start this freaking presentation. Press to play the video. Alan. Boom. What? The following is a GDL certified presentation recorded and made for row. strict use of the GeoDescent Lab grounds only. <clears throat> right. Let's see. Ah, yes. <clears throat> Welcome. <clears throat> Welcome. <clears throat> Welcome to Geo Descent Labs, where digging into the past is of the past, because we're digging into the future instead of the past. <clears throat> okay. My name is Alan Columbus, and I'm the one in charge of running the operations here. So, please do take a seat as the following okay, presentation will outline your mission in adequate detail. Yes. I right. comprehensive, not Approximately adequate. 30 years ago, we sent a bore drill with a two-man crew to create a tunnel to the center of the Earth. However, once that drill reached the core, we lost all communication with the crew. And, um, well, the, 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 the crew themselves. So, the project was completely shut down, due to the unforeseen casualties. I mean, I, mean I, I say unforeseen, but you know the nature of the... <clears throat> now, fast forward to about a year ago, 
we discovered a new type of rock deep down in the earth named noxesium that when cooked at a temperature of 3456 degrees along with a cow's udder, apple cider vinegar, a few gummy bears, dried washing up liquid and a spleen of a... You, you, you know what? In brief, it allowed us to create a new alloy that we managed to translate into a fully fledged metallic wingsuit named the Thermal Flight Armor 1541. I want to wear it. This suit is made to withstand the highest heats known to man, and so we believe, the center of the Earth. This is where you come in. You have been hired for a mission to fly down to the center of the Earth wearing the Thermal Flight Armor 1541 to rescue the long-lost Bordrill. Providing that it's intact, you should be able to use the power in your suits to power it up and drive it all the way back. It would also be nice to recover the bodies of the crew we lost and um, bring them back for their families. Okay, let's talk about how you're going to do it. The Bordrill gradually made its way to the Earth's core through three separate tunnels in a zigzag formation. You will glide using your suits all the way down to the center of the Earth through these tunnels. At the end of Tunnel 1 and 2, there is a base camp that you can use to rest up at. However, beyond Tunnel 3, well, it's all on you at that point. Listen, okay, capiche. I don't know what you're going to find down there, but I'm sure you all agreed upon the possible dangers when you signed up for this job. Right, yeah. as soon as this brief is finished, you'll head out the door behind you and follow the route down to the armory where you will equip your brand spanking new Thermal Flight Armor 1541. Yeah! And then progress to the drop zone. Um, uh, S Sasha? Yeah, yeah? Is it, is it possible to get this recording to um, <clears throat> self-destruct after it's finished? You, you know, uh, like the um, Mission Impossible film. Do I need to run? No. I don't want to blow up. What do you mean, no? Are we done here? Okay. Okay. Ne never mind. Marty. Are we? Are we good? Are we good here, dude? We good? We good? I got. I got the idea. I gotta go. Kaboom! Oh no! It blew up. I gotta go to the center of the Earth and rescue people, right? I hope they're alive. It seems like it was a long time ago, though. Oh, dude, sweet. Okay, this thing opened up. That was magical. All right, man. So we got to go to the armory. Let me see what the mission brief says. GDL mysteriously lost a board drill and a two-man crew. It's been resting in the unknown since. How has it not been melted? I don't know. That's fancy, but we'll, we'll suspend our disbelief there. Glide down to the center of the earth to rescue the long-lost board drill. Because that is of primary importance, not the bodies of the crew. Obviously, machinery first, people later. Anyways, so dude, let's go down to the armory. I want to get my super-duper fancy flight suit. And glide to the center. Why are you all frozen in stuff? What is wrong? This is the second one of you who's been frozen in snow. What's going on here? Testing a new technology that gives you frostbite? I mean, really. What about you, sir? You have some crazy art. What in the... This is... This is some weird stuff, dude. This is pretty cool, though. I'm not even gonna lie. What are you doing here on the... All the computers seem to say the same thing. Are you guys even working? Are you just browsing mine Reddit? Or something. Is that what you do at work all day? Bet that's what you do at work all day. You and your screensavers. Anyway. To the armory! Oh my god. How is it even do? This is technology at its finest. Oh my god, how did you do that? What? I'm, my mind's blown, dude. Of all the things so far, that elevator just blew my mind. Are you even kidding me right now? This is an armory, if I do say so myself. What's up, dudes? You gonna hook me up with the fatty equipment style? Yeah, oh my god! This is amazing. I'm gonna cry. It's so beautiful. How did this happen? A fabled Nox Mammoth. Please do not feed the dumb, dumb shark. Where's the dumb shark? I don't see the dumb shark, but I kind of- Oh, it's there! Oh, wow, I didn't even notice that! That's so cool! You have a freaking aquarium under my feet that has a dumb shark in it? At least not a land shark. I'm sorry, I should be focusing on the mission, but I'm just too amazed. Which color should we get? I was kind of thinking pink. Personally, like I don't I mean, I, I don't know what the difference is between the suits. They kind of all look the same But I was thinking we just get the pink one. So 
Swing boot up sequence initiated. A number of checks will now commence. Please stand by. Wing flexibility check complete. Suit alloy fusion integrity check complete. Inline breathability module flowing. Thermal resistance gel application complete. Welcome to the TFA 1541. I am Ellie and I will accompany you on your journey to the center of the Earth. For your safety, do not attempt to land the suit until I have deployed the landing gear. Of course. Do not dive the TFA 1541 into water, hot liquids, or magma. Isn't the, Enjoy your flight. Isn't the core of the Earth inherently like it is magma? It's just it's just molten iron, I thought. So how am I gonna not? How do you dig through molten stuff and Okay. Yep, say it seems safe to me. Wow, dude, did you even see though? I attended this cool agency conference like a while back and that means I got these red wing upgrades that are the sickest ever. They can probably withstand magma because of the awesomeness. Like you see these, these default little wings over here, dude? They look cool and all, but they aren't these. These puppies are the highest in technology upgradability that you've ever seen in your life. So with that said, Oh my god, am I stoked to go to the center of the earth and probably die. So, yeah, dude. I have never been more stoked to probably die. What? I'm going to the center of the earth and you can't, you're not even paying attention to me? Do you see the man standing in front of you right now? And the mission he's about to selflessly take on? How about a bit of, like, you know? How about a bit of compliments? No? Okay, bud. Wow. To the drop zone! Oh, we're going up. I figured we were going down, but remember, jump again midair to activate your wings. Right, of course. Of course. I'm not just going to completely fail this right off the bat. Terra Swoop Force has arrived. Yeah! This sequence will initiate Applause. upon activation of the Applause for me. controls. Uh, push to start descent. Only drop once the floor hatch is fully opened. Yeah, can I get some applause up in here from the control room, everybody? The Terra Swoop Force, the one and only, has arrived, okay, to make everything better. Didn't get retrieve machinery and not people. Sasha, is that you? Hi, Sasha. Um, how's it going? It's been a long time no see. I know you wanted to make that tape self-destruct, but it's it's okay. Let's see, what do we got over here? New marker is so cool. Uh, one plus two equals, well, I feel very confident at your technology abilities if you can't add uh, bun, cow udder. Oh, they're trying to get the formula for the sandwich. Are you like, is there some office romance or you're just trying, you're like, oh man, I gotta, gotta ask her on a date or something like that. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. It's been fun hanging out in the control room, but I, your boy has to save the world. Oh my god. This doors are preparing to is open. amazing. Please stand clear of the drop zone. Remember, GDL will not be held responsible in the event of a likely death. Your descent will begin in... 3... 2... 1... Terra Swoop Force engaged! Oh my god, we're going to the center of the Earth. There is a lot of foliage here in the center of the Earth. I am not gonna lie. Oh my goodness. Dude, this is... I, I was the perfect person to take on this mission because I have impeccable flight skills, impeccable flight flying abilities, and why do you guys have so much scaffolding in your tunnel to the center of the earth? Good god, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this is incredible. I wanna not hit any walls, I, I imagine. Okay, let's get to that base station, dude. Let's get to that base station, holy crew! oh my god, I'm alive. Wow, I just, uh, did I make it? Did I make it? Uh, landing gear, landing gear, landing gear, landing gear, De deploy the landing gear. I'm alive. Woo. So here we go. We are going to, we're going to head back up here. I assume that we have now checkpointed to the next place. Where did I enter? I entered from there. Okay. I probably, you know, would have been more elegant for me to land on this platform, but that's okay, dude. Do we get to go in like a tram system somewhere else? I don't know. Anyway, this is the this is the sickest thing that's ever happened to me in my entire life. Is all I'm saying. Press to cycle the airlock. Boom. All right. Standing by for rendezvous Please at Alpha Base. For the oxygen renewal chamber to cycle. Yeah. 
<gasps> All right, I can finally breathe again. Ooh, we're good. We're good. Ooh, okay. Okay, why am I so slow? I'm really slow right now. There we go. Ooh. Okay. So this is gonna take me over to the secondary. Oh my god, I can't look in that direction. That's bad. Don't look over there. Don't look over there. Don't look over there. All right, I'm gonna assume this is the second drop zone right here. Looks like it. So, without further ado, let's get this party started. And here, oh, oh, here we go, dude. Here we go. This is definitely drop zone number two. And we have freaking we've got. Oh gosh! <laughs> it just exploded. Wow. Did not expect that. Would've been better off spending a day at the beach. Yeah, I, you know, that's probably fairly accurate. Wait, so I gotta, you want me to go under that thing and then low and then what about up and then low? <sighs> oh, there we go. Yeah, clearing that off. There's a T-Rex in the center of the earth. Wouldn't you know, that's what, that's how Jurassic Park was able to exist. They actually dug into the center of the earth. Wow, didn't uh, expect that. Oh my God. Okay, you're still good. You're still good. You're still good. Thread that needle. Thread that needle, don't you dare hit the ground. Don't you dare hit the ground. You have freaking got, no, 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 no. Keep it going, keep it going strong. Keep it going strong. We are not keeping it going strong and we just exploded in a fiery ball of fire. Oh my goodness. There is only one person who is suitable for this mission and that is your boy, Mr. Explosion Man, who is definitely about to explode, uh, which is not good, but that's okay because I'm gonna gain some speed here. I'm gonna make some sick gains and then we are gonna be right back into the action as soon as I don't have enough speed to make that. Oh, I do have enough speed. <gasps> no, 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 keep it going, keep it going. You actually, this is perfect, because I slowed down a little bit. I slowed down a little bit, yeah. And now this way, I'm gonna be able to make this easier. I was just going too fast. I was playing it in hard mode, which is kind of what I do, dude, because just, it's hard to be this freaking spectacular at flying wingsuits um, and not play in hard mode all the time. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm doing it, I'm good. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why did you build a pirate's cove in the center of the earth? What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh god. Oh god. You had to have that. That terrified me. That vine right there. I almost got destroyed by that thing. Who put that there? Who's not trimming the bushes? Yeah, your boy is pretty. I was only three or four tries, okay? I wasn't counting. Who's counting? Because it was just whatever. Anyway, we gotta cycle that airlock. And then we're we're due. We're on the final leg here. Oxygen renewal chamber to cycle. We're gonna go down and we're gonna save that piece of machinery, dude. And then maybe we'll find the bodies of the crew, but you know what? That's whatever, dude. That's not really a big deal here. Because we're all about the technology. And we're all about saving technology. That poor, helpless, defenseless technology, all alone, stranded at the center of the earth, and I've gotta go retrieve it and return it. All right, everyone. This is where things get real serious. We're on our own here. I think we're on the third leg, which means that we're about to like lose radio contact, probably. And we're probably about to like fly into a molten lava iron core, and I don't really know how they've managed to physics make that tunnel work but okay anyway so which way are we oh my god oh we're going we're going different directions here look at all this mining gear that they just seem to have lost oh god okay okay we're going we're going the other direction this time and maybe that'll be the way to go oh god oh god okay that's not good that's not good that's not good it's gonna make it very difficult <laughs> it's gonna make it very difficult uh okay try this again i feel like the, i feel like the left was a little bit better though so we're gonna keep on we're gonna keep on sticking with that and then maybe make it through. One of these times I'll make it through. One of these times I'll figure out how, with the skipping all over the place, I can make this. I wait, made it. Oh god, this is. Oh wow, what is happening? What is happening? I don't know what's happening here, but there is a lot of something going on here, and I don't know what it is. What is ta What? What? Are those all golf carts? Why are there golf carts all over the place? I don't think that's the way it's supposed to be. I don't think the walls are supposed to be made out of golf carts, and I think that's ruining everything. Yep, found the problem. Apparently Minecraft 1.9 allows you to have a bunch of resource packs active all at the same time. Interesting choice, but nonetheless, still had the golf resource pack active from when we did that thing with Sunday. Turned everything into golf carts. That was, uh, yep, that was the issue. Shall we, uh, get, get going for real this time? I think we shall. Okay, I'm gonna go over to the left still. Oh, I threaded that needle so hard there. Dude, that was so good. Here we are. Oh, everything is so much better now. <laughs> what do you know? What do you? Hey, this looks this looks better. 
few less golf carts on the on the wall. You know, oh, this looks really great. Oh my god. Uh oh. Uh oh. You can keep this going. You can keep this going. There are a lot of things that you risk crashing into here. Oh, we gotta go all the way up. No, you can do it. Yes, yes. You can maybe not. No, 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 no. Rest in pieces. Rubbernecked at the scenery. It's an interesting death message. I'm kind of missing the super duper music though, dude. I kind of feel like I need that in order to power my my flight here, dude. I'm feeling like it's not. I'm not pumped up. But no, boy, let's just. Uh, we're going a little fast here. We're going a little fast for my taste. Oh god, this is a little bit too quick. Hey, at least, at least things are working. Oh, I wonder if I can. If I made it through the rings, if that's kind of where, where you're supposed to do, make it through the rings. Nah, nah. But if we can just at least stay up a little higher this time. Careful, careful. Oh, you got this. Thread that. Thread that. Thread that. Thread that. Oh my god. I don't think this is gonna work. Maybe we can just get some speed and then bring it back up. Bring it back. Oh no, 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 no! You can get it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. I just made that kind of work. I kind of made that work. I kind of making it work. Kind of making it work. Just swoop down through that lava and then I can't see what I'm doing. I didn't see a thing. I didn't. I didn't take an arrow to the knee. I definitely. I took lava to the face and then exploded. But I thought I had that and then it was like, nah, you, you, you don't have. That. I made an amazing recovery there too. And you just refuse to give me the satisfaction of seeing it all the way through. Come on, let's keep this going. Keep it going over here. And then get some get a little bit of speed. Get a little bit of speed. And then swoop skadoodles on through. There we this is exactly what we wanted. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Keep it going. Keep it going. Holy mother of God. Okay, slow yourself down. Slow it down. No, come on, you can do this. You can do it. Whoa, thread the needle right through the where am I going? Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. Where am I going? What are you doing? What happened there? That was like a brick wall in front of me. I made it so far and you're gonna send me all the way back on that one. Of course you are. Here we go. Okay, I might have a little bit much speed coming through here, but you you bet I fixed that. Now, I think we need to go up and over here. Up and, up and over here. There we go. There's only one way through. What do you do? What do you want from me? There we go. There we go. There we go. What are we doing? What are we? Holy! Oh, oh no! They need to fly through the skull's mouth! Damn it! There is definitely a lot of speed in play. In fact, little bit, little bit too much. I think little bit too much, little bit too much speed. I got a little too much speed there. Definitely got too much speed. Okay, we need to not do that. At least I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it through the skull right now. And then once I make it through the skull, I have no idea what's on the other side. So that's really gonna, it's gonna be. If it took me this long to get through the skull, and then I have zero idea as to what even is on the, I'm on fire. That's okay. We're still going. That that makes it look cooler. You know, when you're on fire, trying to. Make things happen. It looks pretty freaking cool. It this I'm on fire for a long period of time right now. Okay, and then yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. Why is there so much in the section? And then and then just go right over here. It's right over here. Yes, thread it right there, right there, and then up, up and over, and then right through that skull hole. Right through that skull hole. Yes. Yes. What did you hit? Didn't hit anything. Are you out of your mind? Are you out of your mind? Are you out of your mind? Because I just didn't hit it. I went through right through the middle of that and you blew me up. You blew me up. You don't even want me to get through, do you? You don't even want it. Hell hath no fury like me raging. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. We made it to a new part. We made it to a new part. And I have no idea what is happening here. All I know is, God, there is a lot of stuff to worry about in this area. Okay, okay, and then, and then, and then, and then he's not gonna... How long is this tunnel? How long is this tunnel? Oh my God. Oh my God. All right. I actually discovered that I had an issue with my resource pack, so... Here we go, the music is back on. I'm, I'm back in the groove, back in the spirit, and we are going to ace. Tunnel number three, because your boy is ready to make this thing happen. Let's do it. Let's do this thing right now. Through those, through those green hoops right there, through those green hoops, and we're gonna make it all the way to the very end of this thing and save the machinery. Not people, just machinery. Machinery is the most important thing on this entire mission right now. So here we go. Here we freaking go. This is gonna be it right now right this second all right and over the wall over the wall and then through the freaking through the mouth through the eye of the through the eye of the storm and thread the needle this way thread the needle that way thread the needle all the ways thread it every way possible 
so much threading of needles going on. It is so freaking sick. You can't even imagine how sick the plays are. Right now, here we go. Landing, you're deployed. Safe to land. Woo! Okay, so there's a, there's no base station here, actually. So how do, what is this place? This is gnarly. Okay, so here we go. We gotta like, go down here. Uh, uh, wingsuit, whoa, what are we? Why is the core all icy? It doesn't even make any sense. The core, the core is- The suit is nearing the maximum temperature it can withstand. There, Please proceed with caution. There's ice. You, you realize it's ice down here. I don't know how it's hot and icy. I guess maybe it's just such high pressure that, that that's how it's working. Maybe it's the, the pressure dealio here. What do we have down? Oh God, do I have more of a course here? I'm in first person. I'm not equipped. I'm not equipped for this. Oh, it's okay. Okay, we don't have to worry. We, we can't die there. All right, and then what is it? Okay, oh, is this the thing? Is this the drill? Oh, drill, please be intact. Please be in good shape, man. Okay, the airlock is opening. Why it doesn't see it? How is there ice coexisting right next to lava? This is a weird environment, dude. I figured it was gonna be molten please iron all over. For the airlock to cycle. Okay, that's an ominous voice there. Waiting for the airlock to cycle. That does not sound like it is in very good condition. I'm going to be okay. Okay, cool your jets there. It's a lot of air we're pumping in. A lot of air. You're gonna you're gonna give me the bends or something with this change of pressure and stuff. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. That doesn't seem good. I just wipe out the power supply for the ship. Uh, what's going on? In that doesn't look good. Papers scattered all about and stuff. Things broke. Yeah, things don't look too great oh here. God. What? Oh my God. Dr. Barney. It can't be. I, Are you real? I, 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 I am. I believe my eyes. I've waited so long for this. So long. I have yearned for this moment and it has finally come. I don't know what to say. What? Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, you must be surprised. I'm still alive after all this time. <laughs> I don't even know how long it's been since Dr. Minowski left my side. Well, after we ran out of actual food, we had to train our stomachs to survive off the drill itself. <laughs> you ate metal? Which didn't taste so bad. After a while, that is. <laughs> and you know, I always thought the guy was a little bit fishy, but really, I thank the heavens that Minowski brought his 5,000-page annotated hardback of Dr. Wolf's motivational philosophies. The pictures certainly added a refreshing taste to the diet every so often. He ate the book. Minowski. Poor, oh dear. Poor Minowski. And then he ate him. Where did you go, Minowski? In your stomach. I just noticed. Those... those suits. They, they were working on prototypes for those suits for years, but these, yeah, it's pretty these fancy. look completely different, really modernized. I must have been down here for too long. Yeah. Wow. When I was still surfaced, the wings were only a dream. I had no idea they'd be able to make them a reality. Would you, would you mind if I had a look? Just, you know, try it on. <laughs> You know, for for Minowski's sake. Oh, oh, Minowski. Okay, walk up to Dr. Barney and press Q to give him the suit. I'm a little bit worried what he's going to do is he's going to take the suit and he's going to bolt on out of here. He's going to be like, see you later, sucker. That was, by the way, I do just want to say, that was amazing. I've never seen something like that before with a Minecraft model, like walking choreographed to speech. How in the heck was that anyway? Okay, I'm gonna press, give you the suit. This is great, so perfect. Don't, don't steal it from me, don't steal it from oh, me. It feels so comfortable. You don't have my fancy wings though, man. If only Minowski was here to see it. Don't worry, Minowski. I will avenge you. You see, that core stared at us all day, every day, slowly reaching oh, into crazy. our souls and crippling us. Whoa. Then, after a while, we began to notice 
They came to the core one by one. They started off just taking small pieces of it, like crumbs. <laughs> then they came with their massive platters and began carving juicy ten-ounce slices of it. What? Mm. What? What are you talking about? Uh, uh, so before it could get any worse, we built a cannon into the side of the drill. A cannon to fight off those darn evil tunnel pirates before what? they could eat up all the core. It's not theirs. It's mine. Uh, mine and Minowski's, of, of course. Right. This is it. We will not witness our mother of crops being robbed ever again, because this time, this time, I am going in. Minowski. This is for you! Curses to the Tunnel Pirates! I will stop them once and for all! With this brand new suit, nothing will be able to stop me! <laughs> no, don't, don't do that! Don't do that! Don't do that! It's a blessing! Don't do that! 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 Please don't do that! I'm gonna- There are no Tunnel Pirates! There are no Tunnel Pirates and that's the core of the Earth, you idiot! Well then, that's really not good. External temperature rising at abnormal rate. Yet, you thought the core was food after all these years, and you just wasted the suit, and you blew up the earth. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. That's really bad. We're all gonna die. All right, we're all gonna die. That's really bad. That's really bad. Holy crap. Oh my god. There are literal shockwaves going through the cabin right now. This is amazing, but also horrifying. We're dead. We're dead. How do I get out of this one? How am I going to get out of this? How do I get out of this one? How do I... I'm, oh, it's blown out. Oh, the core of the earth is blown. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the earth is gone. God... Dang it, Dr. Barney. God dang it. I mean, that's a real, that's a real the end right there. That is a real the end. Literally, it's the end of everything. That we've ever known. You know what? That... That's the greatest map I've ever played in my entire life. That is the greatest, that is unbelievable. Wow. Wow. How did you do that? I don't even know, but that was un unbelievable. Holy mother of God. Okay, I hope you all enjoyed that. Um, yeah, dude. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like if you liked, and if you want to check out the map for yourself, give it a try. Uh, all the Knox crew links and download will be in the description and all that stuff. Check out more maps via the playlist in the description. Subscribe for more videos, and I think... We'll probably leave it off there. Oh, wow. That was, that was Narbuckle and a half. Yeah, jeez. Wow, I'll leave it, I'll leave it off the credits so that all the people who put, put effort into this, they, you know, get shown because that was crazy. Anyway, peace out from me.